Did you know that the visual effects team for Interstellar created the most realistic black hole ever seen on screen? They didn't just use CGI magic. Instead, they worked closely with physicist Kip Thorne to accurately depict the warping of space-time around a black hole, something never done before in cinema. The result? A black hole called Gargantua that's not only visually stunning but scientifically accurate. It was even so groundbreaking that it ended up being used in scientific papers about astrophysics. Speaking of scientific accuracy, did you know that Miller's planet, the one closest to the black hole Gargantua, is based on real scientific principles? In the movie, the planet experiences extreme time dilation, meaning that every hour spent on the surface equals seven years of time in space. This phenomenon happens due to the immense gravitational pull of the nearby black hole. The closer you get to a black hole, the stronger its gravity, and time slows down dramatically. It's a real scientific theory. Speaking of that giant wave, did you know that the filmmakers used groundbreaking technology to create the massive tidal wave on Miller's planet? To make it look as realistic as possible, the visual effects team didn't rely on just CGI. They used a combination of practical effects and visual simulations to replicate the effect of gravity distorting the water. They created the feeling that the entire planet's surface was being pulled toward the black hole, creating waves of unimaginable size. The wave is one of the most memorable visual moments in the film and a true testament to the power of physics, 